Good evening, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live, and uh, I want to just quickly update you. I had, of course, I was out all day today. I had to, doctor's appointments and stuff uh, that I had to take care of. Uh, not the best news in the world, but, you know, we're trusting the Father uh, for what all is going to have to be taken care of. But I want to go real quick into some things here. We're going to drop back here in just a moment here to Patrick Lancaster, where he is covering the war in Ukraine. Please keep him in prayer. Uh, this this young man is right there on the front lines. Uh, he's going to be talking here in just a few minutes about the Maripol, uh, the last stand of the Azov battalions there, and the Russians pushing them out of there. Uh, but before I go into there to share that with you, uh, Biden, of course, is already... Uh, pushing for more. I'm afraid he's going to get us right into a nuclear war if we're not careful. Then you have Russia. Uh, let's see here. Where do we have this here? Russia also, um, let's see, firing off Hal Turner showing the missile here. The Satan II. I think it's four years ago Russia did that as well. And um, so, you know, Russia once again uh, testing the Satan II, as they call it, uh, intercontinental uh, uh, su supersonic missile. And uh, so, you know, it is very, very serious. And uh, I think Putin is letting this to be known that there's a situation that uh, that we're dealing with here that uh, they're, they're very serious about no one intervening. At the same time, though, I cannot help but think a new world order. And it doesn't seem to matter which side you're looking at on this war. It's all to bring about a global collapse. It's all to bring about and set up a new world order. So there's not one side better than the other when it comes to that. They're all playing their parts. And so it's just a matter of time before we get affected in other areas as well. So I want to make sure you guys were aware of that too. Um, so let's go real quick. I'm going to just close out real quick. I want to play a little bit here of what uh, is being said by Paul uh, Lancaster there. And uh, I see his channel is just growing leaps and bounds, leaps and bounds, because he is on the front lines and people get to see what's really going on. Let's listen in. And this is what we call a true stream battle. This is how it goes here in Mariupol. We're, what, 6, 60, 70 uh, meters from as of battalion the Ukrainian soldiers. And they are getting hit hard right now. We're gonna see how this plays out. He's gonna zoom in on the trees there. And uh, in just a moment there, and just even the trees have suffered so tremendously. Uh, you know, from all the shelling, the bullets, is just unbelievable the amount of uh, firepower that's taking place there uh, in Mariupol, uh, Ukraine right now. So there we go there. You can you just see the fragments of the trees, the bombs and everything, the shells, the, the, the firepower that's going on. By the way, right outside of my window, uh, I'll mention this as well. Winds are again massively blowing. I don't even know know why. Uh, it's a beautiful clear day when we come in this evening. Not a cloud in the sky. And now suddenly huge winds again. Just the other day we had 70 mile per hour winds here. Uh, extremely unusual. In fact, uh, the locals, friends that, I, that I've come to have here since living here, have said in their lifetime, they have not seen those types of winds in this part of Tennessee. Uh, and that, uh, so it's not to say that it hasn't happened before, but we were talking about sustained, not just a sudden gust, but building up, building up. In fact, it woke me up like four o'clock in the morning. And as I'm recording here, I hadn't been out in about an hour, it's calm about an hour ago, but now I hear the winds just blowing like crazy outside. And then I'm thinking, you know, we got these five planets that are lining up here pretty soon. And, uh, and of course, I haven't even shared some of the things uh, that have been shared with me a couple of weeks ago about all the different events that we can expect this year. Kind of been 
laying a little bit low on some of these things there because I don't want to cause everybody panic and stuff. But more and more, I'm seeing it. And, I, and I've been told that when you get to the fall of the year, you know, it's just going to slowly but surely things are going to increase. And we're not just talking about with, with weather events and things like that, but also with war. So uh, listen, we love you. We appreciate you. We thank you for, for being a part of this ministry. And, uh, and, and do keep our family in prayer. Uh, and uh, I'll, I'll probably share a little bit later more about what was going on uh, with my back. And like I said, you know, you, there's many of you that helped uh, raise funds for the surgery that I'm supposed to have done. Uh, but I don't know if because I waited too long. Well, maybe not because initially I think they were only going to operate on one disc. But now I found out today it'll have to be three. Uh, they said that's why I have a complete numbness in the entire left leg. Good thing is, though, it's the left side of the disc all the way down. L3, L4, and L5 all blown out, but with a complete loss of feeling. So I have a very difficult time walking, um, but just keep us in prayer. And uh, so looks like at this point now, <laughs> I, I kept trying to put it off. You know, I mean, I was supposed to have already had the surgery done. And then, of course, uh, as you guys know, my father-in-law passed away. So uh, the family has really been in a major turmoil over that. And it kind of put everything to the back burner of what was going on. Uh, but um, but at this point now, got to, got to do something now. So, uh, in fact, I've, I'm, I'm getting it to where the one of these things where you don't have much time, period, because you could go to permanent, permanent loss of uh, the feeling in that leg or even go into full-blown paralysis. So God bless you. Thank you for listening. Uh, if you want to support the ministry, God lays it upon your heart, please do. IsraeliNewsLive.org. You can do that. And also our videos, they post here. There's a nice, uh, also a nice, you can drop in there and, and see all the latest videos that are loaded up through iConnect, but it'll play actually on our website. And, uh, and also, because of all these wars and knowing that this stuff is going to come our way, and I've got one sister too. I'd promise to help on one of these as well. Um, uh, you, you know, blesses our ministry as well if you decide to get one. But I just think it's a, a, a good way to... Uh, um, uh, and Brother Ethan, uh, I'll have to catch you tomorrow. So and he's, he, he's sending me a text right now. Love you, Brother Ethan. Um, uh, but... I, I need to, uh, I was just going to say, if you decide, God lays, not so lays, I say lay on your heart. In other words, if you feel like there's something that you need that's going to help your family, let me just quickly show you some of their products there. They have them for the vehicles. They have them for your generator. If you have a generator, solar panels, I still have never got my solar panels installed. Uh, I need to. Uh, in fact, if you happen to know anything about really knowing how to install solar panels, uh, and could contact me, that would be wonderful. Uh, just put solar panel Stephen Benoon at, uh, at gmail.com. Send me an email. So, but anyway, uh, if you, no matter which one you want to get, radios even, for example, radio protection, you click on it, uh, you decide you need that one right there, which I don't know anything about these things. I need a ham radio myself. I still wish I'd already gotten one, but I haven't done it yet. Uh, and then you add it to your cart. But when you add it to your cart, if you do, you go to the cart, you do the coupon code, INL50, and you apply that coupon code, that particular protection device goes from $309 down to $259. They take off $50. And they also help support the work we do here. So we appreciate it as well. So then you go to checkout and you say, and it doesn't matter if you buy one or if you buy 10 items. It'll be $50 off every single time you buy one. So... Um, and, you know, I think it's just a good insurance policy. That's all I have to say about that. Anyway, thank you. God bless you. And hope to talk to you soon.